As presumptive Republican presidential nominee Mitt Romney transitions into the general election, Texas Congressman Ron Paul says the GOP race is not over yet. The man with the growing fan base also has a growing roster of delegates. Chief political correspondent Carl Cameron looks at what Paul's end game might be. Do you know there's a still ongoing presidential race in this country? If Paul wins a plurality of delegates in five states, his name could be offered up for nomination in Tampa, which could win him lots of attention at Romney's convention. This weekend at the Maine State GOP convention, Paul backers elected 23 out of 24 delegates for Paul. But Romney won the Maine caucuses earlier this year. Romney won Nevada, too, but at his state GOP convention over the weekend, Paul Backers laid claim to 22 of 28 delegates. Romney won his home state primary of Massachusetts. But Paul delegates so dominated the Bay State's recent GOP convention that Paul Backers could control more than half the state's delegation at the national convention. Embarrassing for the presumptive nominee. Rick Santorum won Louisiana and Minnesota at the ballot box, but he withdrew from the race, and that allowed Paul backers in both states to secure delegate majorities at both those states' recent GOP conventions. And in the next three months, Paul is hoping to pack more state delegations with his supporters in states like Washington, Missouri, Nebraska, Idaho, and even Iowa, the First the Nation caucus state. They are all but certain to nominate Romney, but their numbers suggest that when they get to the convention, a lot of it's going to be about Ron Paul, Brett. Could be interesting. Carl, thank you.